Learn English with Grammar Guru. Simple Present Tense. Welcome to Grammar Guru, your go to channel for English language learning. In this video, we will dive into the world of verb tenses, specifically focusing on the simple present tense. Mastering the simple present tense is crucial for effective communication, as it allows us to talk about habitual actions, general truths, and scheduled events. So, let's get started and unravel the mysteries of the simple present tense. The simple present tense is used to talk about actions or states that are regular, habitual, or factual. It is formed by using the base form of the verb, also known as the infinitive, without any conjugation. For example, I walk to school every day. She likes chocolate. The sun rises in the east. In each of these sentences, we use the base form of the verb, walk, like, and rise without any changes to indicate actions or states that are ongoing or generally true. 2.1 Habits and Routines One of the most common uses of the simple present tense is to talk about habits and routines. We use it to describe actions that we do regularly or repeatedly. For example, I brush my teeth twice a day. He plays the guitar every evening. They watch movies on Fridays. By using the simple present tense, we can express activities that are part of our daily, weekly, or regular routines. 2.2 General Truths and Facts Another important use of the simple present tense is to express general truths and facts. We use it to talk about things that are always true or generally accepted. For example, Water boils at 100 degrees Celsius. The earth revolves around the sun. Cats like to chase mice. In these sentences, we are stating facts or expressing commonly known truths using the simple present tense. 2.3 Scheduled Events and Timetables The simple present tense is also used to indicate scheduled events and timetables. We use it to talk about future events that are part of a fixed schedule. For example, the train arrives at 9 a.m. The conference starts next Monday. The class ends at 3 p.m. Using the simple present tense in these cases helps us express events that are already planned or scheduled to happen in the future. Congratulations! You've made it through the world of the simple present tense. By now, you should have a good understanding of how to use this tense to talk about habits, routines, general truths, and scheduled events. Keep practicing and incorporating the simple present tense into your everyday English conversations. Don't forget to check out our other videos on verb tenses and grammar fundamentals to continue enhancing your English language skills. Happy learning, and see you in the next video!